Once again, ladies and gentlemen, this pound is good for three five-minute rounds in the lightweight division. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner, is a mixed martial artist standing five feet, 10 inches tall. Weighing it officially 154 and one half pounds. In five bouts, he has three victories, one defeat, and one no contest. Finding out of Liverpool, England, here is Alice Hepson. And next is opponent across the cage, finding out of the red corner. Also a mixed martial artist, he stands five feet, 11 inches tall. Weighing in 155 and three quarter pounds. This young professional is perfect in the cage. Three bouts, three victories, and no defeats. From Sunderland, England, here is the undefeated Louis Monard. <laughs> Referee in charge, Mark Goddard. Referee Mark Goddard about to get this one underway. Three five-minute rounds if they need them. Cage Warriors, lightweight division, Ellis Hampson in the black shorts, Louis Monarch in the white with grey trim, touch of gloves, and we are underway. Really don't expect this fight to last long one way or another. Monarch just 20 years old, Ellis Hampson slightly older at 23. Pretty interesting stance from Ellis Hampson, but early entry into the body lock from Monarch. Both guys swinging in the pocket. Nice knee to the body from Monarch. These guys certainly leaving it all on the line here at Cage Warriors 73. The crowd showing their appreciation. Hampson just getting a little bit wild there for a moment. We saw already the threat of those knees coming in the clinch from Monarch. A couple of good knockouts via that method for him. Monarch going looking for that knee up the middle. Both men remaining light on their toes. Nice combination from Monarch, landed some slick punches there, Josh. And the uppercut finding the mark as well. He's the one controlling the range at the moment. Trying to press his opponent back into a corner. Monarch's taken the centre of the cage. Hampson content at this point to circle around. To the last right hand there, though. Yeah, Monarch landed a good short shot there. Nice Throw body it. punch from Ellis Hampson there. But throwing in good combinations, actually they both got very good head movement as well. Good body punching is something we're seeing a lot more of now in MMA. It's one of the more underutilised techniques. Obviously we see a lot of it in boxing and kickboxing, but really finding a home in MMA now is the body shot. Wild punches from both men. Yeah, tie clinch now. A lot of control here if he can get it working. Two there, Hampson coming right back though, looking for the spin. Oh, here. giving up his back though. Let's see if he can turn into the cage here, but it's a very strong grip for Lewis Monarch. Able to defend the first takedown attempt was Hampson. Oh, and very interestingly, he gives up that grip. Very surprising decision from the 20-year-old. Looking for the knee there, didn't quite get it though. Again, starting his combination with the body punch was Alice Hampson. Hampson. Monarch, though, looking very comfortable here on his feet. Hampson just, uh, sorry, Monarch just finding some of the better shots at the shorter ranges. And he's really, you know, motioning like he's stalking Hampson here. Hampson forced to stay on the outside, trying to circle. combination here from Lewis Monarch, he caught him with the right hand on the end of that one, again looking for that tight clinch. Just manages to get the whizzer in, head position nicely up under the chin. Again looking to separate and throw on the break. Nice combination shot from Ellis Hampson there, but some of the zip has come off Ellis Hampson's punches and Lewis Monarch is unloading here. Well, these are such good, tight, still very technical combinations. I think you see in these in these flurries where they get stuck in the pocket, the tighter technical work is coming from Lewis Monarch. Nice knee there from Lewis Monarch. Oh, he's unloading here. 
We could be seeing the beginning of the end, Josh. Ellis Hampson swinging back. Yeah, I don't think he needs to clinch here. I mean, he's doing a good job of pitting his, his man against the cage, and a good takedown from Hampson. It's the trip on the back leg. Great work from Ellis Hampson there. Here's the triangle choke, though, from Lewis Monarch. It's such a quick entry. And there's the submission. Lewis Monarch with the first round triangle choke. Phenomenal stuff from the young man from Team Fish Tank. Well, he's got three wins by TKO, now picks up his first by submission as a professional, and once again keeps it in the very first round. And Josh, we predicted that this one would not go the distance and maybe not even see the end of the first round. We were right. Let's take a look at some of the action now. There's plenty of it. A nice confident start of Melis Hampson. Knees to the body, punches to the body. Lewis Monarch, though, yeah, well, giving as good as he got. I think the thing is, Monarch's uh, combinations just stayed tighter the whole time. You know, the straight shots, as you saw there, were straighter. The hooks were a little bit cleaner, worked the body, worked the head and really dictated where this fight was going to take place. But of course, he got the job done on the ground. Beautiful punches, nice knee to the body there from Lewis Monarch. Just clinical with his striking, nearly everything landing. You see him go to the body again, and here's the submission finish. Perfect angle on that triangle. There's the tap, and we'll throw this one to Joe Martinez in the cage to make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, the end comes at the official time. Four minutes, 12 seconds, round number one. Submission by Triangle for your winner. And still undefeated, Lewis Monarch! Lewis Monarch remains undefeated as both an amateur and now a professional. A bright future for the 20-year-old from Sunderland, England.